what's up towners um i just wanted to make sure that i jumped on here today and post this video because today is the two-year anniversary of me posting the very first video on youtube the uh scrambled eggs in the carbon steel skillet trying to just showing off the carbon steel skillet that i had and was able to get it seasoned um the original first video could have been um the swai i actually remade i think it was like the third video the swai uh black and swai and with jalapenos and also had some cabbage with that um but i think i may have told you guys this earlier but it was um the very first video was i was on the phone talking with uh my sister-in-law uh, miss rice lifestyle and we were talking for like 45 minutes or so and while we we're talking I had to cook dinner so I put the phone on my tripod and started cooking angled it down towards the camera angled it down towards the uh, food and started cooking and when I was done cooking um, we we're wrapping up on the phone I was like for one this is the longest conversation we've ever had on the phone uh, but two I was like I could have posted that we could have been on Instagram live or something like that and she was like yeah you should do that you should post that so and a few days later, I was like, why not? Let's just try it out. So I posted the first video, and here we are. <laughs> um, like, I think uh, I always wanted to do, like, something uh, food-related. Like, uh, I kind of want to be, like, a line cook for some reason. I want to, like, a, a line chef just busting out orders really quick. I just want to try it. I don't want to do it for... Uh, living I just want to try once or twice to see how that is but that and I think the first thing I was supposed to do, me and my friend Joe we were supposed to make hot sauce we were supposed to make a make a hot sauce brand and that never happened and we never got around to it um, but I always wanted to cook I always wanted to show what I cook I mean you know you always got people oh that look nasty oh I don't like that but this with the Keto, it was, I guess it just came at the perfect time. Um, my wife's birthday, let's say it was last week, and two years ago was right the day after her birthday was when Atlanta shut down where I'm at. And filming the video and posting those, I don't, I'm not gonna say coronavirus, but I, think, I would say it definitely helped because we didn't have nothing else to do. So after I posted that first video, it was kind of like, why not just keep it up, keep it going? And it ballooned from there. But just looking back at that first video, it was just, it was just camera facing to cook the eggs. Peace out. <laughs> but just the growth from there, going from posting the video and then adding the description in the videos, then getting over shyness or getting comfortable with speaking on the camera then eating on the camera and then doing a live and things like that just the progression and, and going more and more into it getting more comfortable in doing it um it's crazy how how much it changed and then also just looking back it's also like a video i view i use it as a as a way to video capture life like i hope you guys don't get uh or some people are like, oh, this is a food channel. Why are you posting videos of your family and things like that? And I'm like, this is my channel for one, but not, not like that. But I mean, I'm like, hey, I mean, might as well document that as well. And because just looking back and I'm like, okay, it's two years ago. And I'm looking back at another video. I'm seeing my kids from two years ago. And I'm like, in my eyes, I could have sworn they looked exactly how they look today, two years ago. But then looking back at the video, I'm like, man, you guys were small. You, you, you know, you've really grown up in these last two years. So um just the growth and the change is just crazy just thinking back on that but thank you guys <laughs> uh what's going on next is uh I, I, if anybody has purchased any of the cooking with the town seasonings um well actually i can go back to what the growth going from that also making the seasonings and making the clothing apparel and things like that just along with the growth of the channel is still crazy 
But um, from the seasonings, I will be coming out with a new seasoning soon, a steak seasoning. So to go along with all the other 10 flavors that we have, I'm coming out with a steak seasoning. I was trying to work on a sweet uh, seasoning, like a, a chocolate chocolate seasoning or a cinnamon sugar seasoning. Um, I might still try to do that, but the steak season is definitely will be coming soon and also a fry mix. So the fry mix could be used on chicken, steak, I'm sorry, steak. Oh, yeah, you could, chicken fry steak. But now chicken, uh, fish, anything basically you want to fry, it'd be basically a, a almond, almond flour based seasoning uh, mix. And you can pretty much mix it with any one of the other seasonings to flavor it if you want, or just do it for the breading aspect of it. But you know, steak seasoning and fry season is fry seasoning coming soon. And uh, I'm just super tired right now, I'm sorry. Um, I've been up, I was up all last night trying to work on this, uh, but I'll tell you guys now, but, um, we have Cooking With The Town 2 website out now, um, www.cookingwiththetown2.com. You can go to that site. Um, it's crap right now. It's, <laughs> it's crap. Uh, I don't know how to make a website and I'm doing it all myself. Um, uh, I made the seasoning site, but that was only just one page. Just load the stuff and that's it. With this site, it's it's a blog site, so it's it's it has all it's gonna be it's gonna eventually have all the recipes that we have on the YouTube channel. But it's kind of like a puzzle. Like you 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 change one thing and it affects what's listed on this page, and then the the listing of the different subgroups that you have. Um, it's challenging because I have no experience in doing that, but I'm learning it as I go. So it'll, it'll hopefully eventually work out, but um, don't judge me based off how it looks right now. It's gonna to continue to keep changing. So <laughs> until I think I like how it looks, so. But all the information is gonna be on there. Um, the reason why I'm doing it is because uh, I've been noticing that a lot of my recipes have been on other pages. Like I can see people some like somebody sharing like on pictures or something, but they're actually, um, copying everything like the whole page and basically making their own website channel and for when I first saw it I was like okay you know cool you know people are watching the videos okay then I uh, start seeing it more and more but then uh, one video the uh, I think it was the 100 pound weight loss video or the one year anniversary video someone copied and posted that one I'm like why would you I can see if it was a recipe like this meal but why would you copy that video and post that on your page as if that's you doing that because there's no food being cooked on any of that and then people were commenting on the videos you know saying hey thank you or good job or uh whatever and i couldn't reply back to them i couldn't uh, one one of them i was able to say hey this isn't this is this is this is me this is like really me this is not my channel but I couldn't reply back and then someone deleted it. So um, I'm like, okay, let me just go ahead and, and um, move all the information over to my channel and let it go from there. People may still copy the information and take it and paste it, but at least it'll come from me. So um, that's basically why I decided to do that. So it'll be basically the uh, information will be listed on in the description box like previously, but it'll just have a link to the Cooking With The Town 2 page. So it sh shouldn't be hard to find or anything. You'll basically look in the description box, it'll be a link, you click on that link, it'll take you directly to the information you're looking for. So hopefully people don't get discouraged by that, but I just feel I wanna do that just for, uh, for my sake, I guess. Um, um, what else? <laughs> Uh, I just want to say thank you. Uh, thank you. You know, there's a lot of people that's been rocking with us for a whole time. Some new, some old, but some people rocking with us tough. And they are on every video, um, no matter when I post it. I try to keep it consistent. I try to post a, try to post around the same time ish, noon ish, twelve one two. Uh, but sometimes things happen and i don't get to post till like later in the day eight nine i think the other day i posted around 11 close to midnight and uh ren commented and was like why am i watching this delicious food at midnight <laughs> like, like thanks ren um but some people are commenting on every video which thank you um let's see who, who, who uh marquita 
Anderson, Ren, uh, Benita Curry, Juki PMP, uh, Miss L. Lewis. Hope you did good on that egg fast. Happy birthday, Marquita. Um, Shantae Holmes, Margaret Mack. There's some other ones. Hopefully, uh, I'm, I'm going to forget some people, but you know who you are, and thank you for commenting. And also some YouTubers. Um, it's a community. It's YouTube is, is definitely a community, and you have some channels that, you know, follow us and, and, and just, you know, enjoy each other's videos and, you know, show the love. Um, Cooking with Neighbors, Jerry Allen, she is great. She, she comments like crazy. Uh, G Rich, doing great. Um, Black Tie Kitchen, I, I really enjoy that dude's videos. He makes movies. He, he, he is, uh, some of the stuff is, most of the stuff is keto or low carb, but he plays like every role and he makes movies, like super production. And uh, I really enjoy his videos. Uh, Thomas is keto cooking. Uh, I enjoy his videos also. Uh, Miss Rice Lifestyle, she does her thing too with her, with her noon cooking, but it's a community. It's a community. Um, showing love supporting each other and helping each other grow and um just keep it going um i think right now i i think i checked today i think i was very close to like seven thousand subscribers i think i was like i was like three or four away from seven thousand and that's crazy 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 that's seven thousand new people in the world support what i do and thanks i can't say nothing else but thank you um keep commenting um i know some of the videos don't really i mean i get views but the people don't really comment that much so keep commenting i like the interaction uh i enjoy the interaction also um there's one person that hit me up on reddit a lot of people they message me directly like on instagram or facebook or something and i'll be like man throw that on the channel put it on put it on there so everybody can see it instead of just direct direct like direct at me but it was one person on reddit that that messaged me and told me that She's like, I'm so glad I found your channel. I love your videos. My husband loves your videos. Um, I forget if she says her husband had lost either like 40 or 75 pounds, but she was like, he basically watches the videos and tells me like, oh yeah, cook that tonight, cook that tonight, cook this, cook that. And she said that he lost around, I forget if it was 40 or 75 pounds, but um, she said it really, you know, thank you for helping, helping us and helping him lose weight. And I'm like, what? I mean, it's crazy. Like, I mean, it worked for me, and I mean, I'm just, you know, trying to sh sh help someone else and show what I eat and the things I eat or how I eat. Just, you know, you don't have to follow me to a T, but you can take that and show, do what you've learned off of it and keep it going for yourself. Um, not necessarily be for weight loss, just eat healthier and things like that. But for her to tell me that they lost that much weight together and it's really working and that I'm the one who kind of basically helped do it for them, that was inspiring for me um so thank you and i really like hearing stuff like that um i showed that to my wife i showed that to my mom i was like look at this <laughs> look at this comment but definitely uh, keep commenting um on whatever video i try to get back to everybody who's commented on them um uh some of them I'm, i don't i have to keep going back in and check because there's some some comments are, are hailed i don't i don't know how to change that some comments are i don't see those until i go back and actually check that box of hailed or blocked comments um but um i just kind of i mean hey good or bad i just kind of hey thanks for watching <laughs> but um thank you guys uh again um what's next i don't know um i don't know Give me some ideas, guys. Send me some messages and tell me what you guys like. Tell me what you like to eat um, or make. I don't, you guys know I don't eat a lot of different wild, crazy stuff. I'm simple. Chicken, beef, pork, fish. I don't really try to go venture out crazy like that. But if it's hot, I eat it. But um, thank you, guys. Again, thank you, thank you, thank you. Two years on YouTube and... I'm, I'm enjoy doing it, so we'll keep it going. Um, thank you guys, and we'll see you in the next video. All right. Enjoy, and please subscribe. Enjoy.
Hey Towners, please like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them in the comment section. All ingredients and directions are listed in the description box below each video. And as always, thank you guys for watching.